everybody, Femi Fems. It's a great day, honey buns. Take your love vitamin. So I have a message for the collective of the divine feminine. Um, I heard spiritually adopted. You're getting ready to be adopted into a family or someone is going to be adopted into your family. Some of you all, your lifestyles are going to change. Um, you're going to start having a lot of deja vu. Others of you all, there's something about your life that's going to change drastically because the spirit of adoption is upon you. Now, this could be emotional, mental, uh, and physical. One or the other or all of the above. But the spirit of adoption is upon you heavily. Uh, some of you all, your life is going to change right before your eyes. So the Holy Spirit just kept giving me the spirit of adoption. It's upon you. The spirit of the Lord is uh, being poured out on you. People are going to notice and witness the evidence of the Lord in your life. The Holy Spirit. So let's take a look. Uh, they're giving me that movie trading places with uh eddie murphy and that guy i can't remember you're getting ready to trade places something good is getting ready to happen i see the will of fortune in my third eye a major shift a major change fortune good luck favor is on your side unmerited favor is what the holy ghost is saying right now Let's get this message. Uh, I keep hearing the word family as well. You're going to be a part of a family or someone is coming. There's something new coming to you and your family. I want to say congratulations in advance. You all deserve this. Take, did I say that? Take your love vitamin. Take your love vitamin. Now, y'all, you know this video is taking a little time to upload, honey. So whenever it upload, I post it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right, let's get this message. All right, well, they need to know Holy Spirit, Divine Feminine. What do you need to know, Divine Feminine, Holy Spirit? Morning do. It's something you're doing. Some, I feel like some of you all, you are manifesting something. Whatever you are manifesting, it, 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 it's, it's happening faster than what you know. I also can smell something. So you all could be using like oils, fragrances, incense. incense. Um, you could be wearing some. Somebody must be having some sort of oil. It's something you're manifesting. Clarity, a fresh start. I told you a positive outlook. Can y'all see that card up close? Something is taking place in your life and you're getting ready to see it's it's materializing, not getting ready, it's materializing. Whatever you're whatever you're doing, whatever you have tapped into, honey, keep doing it. It's gonna give you a fresh start, it's gonna give you a positive um outlook. And I keep hearing look 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 many people are going to begin to look at you many people are going to begin to see you you're going to bring in clarity for other people some of you all you're getting ready to start something uh also you all cleanse your hair very well honor your hair acknowledge your hair the way your ancestors would there's something here with water as well so do your work with water cleansing releasing purging but you're manifesting something a brand new start overall it says the sacred waters yeah there's something sacred going on with you and water so some of you all know how to work with water it could be some sort of ritual spiritual bath um getting in the ocean uh getting in the river purging uh expelling things from your life old energies because you have a lot of newness around you all right the card says nourishment replenishment health uh, rest, self-care, take heed to your health. It's not that anything is wrong, but you want to make sure you're doing your due diligence, eating right, getting your adequate sleep, uh, resting, healing your mind, your body, and your soul because you're manifesting. All right, Holy Spirit, Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine, what do they need to know? See this tower card? A major break is getting ready to take place. A tower, this type, towers are not always bad. This is a major epiphany, a major realization, a major breakthrough. This breakthrough is something that some of you all could have been working on, manifesting for a long time. What you've been doing in secret is going to materialize. Also, others of you all, <clears throat> you're, gonna, you're going to get a break at something, an open door. This is like magical. I hear open sesame. 
whatever these affirmations are someone is using is working for you your affirmation your your prayers something you're writing down i do hear the word ritual so it's a ritual that you tap into it's a healthy ritual it's a ritual to help you manifest good job all right holy spirit divine feminine the seven of pentacles now the seven of pentacles this could be a relationship for many of you all Others of you are a partnership. There is some sort of order the Lord is bringing to your life. This is divine order. It's, it's, it's time for you to have something, something you've been waiting on for a long time. This is a, this is the ending of a very hard delay with the Ten of Swords here. This is also for some of you all that's been backtracked, backstabbed, or betrayed in families. It's like you've been waiting. Oh, you're being released from relatives. And God is allowing you to be adopted into families, your birth family, your spiritual families. So this definitely can be marriage. It could be um, a partnership that you, like those of you all that do business and work with people, God is placing you with the people that are more like you. You know, we're born, what was that? We're born into um, our bloodline. Um, and those of our relatives, you don't have any control over that. Something you've been waiting to have a family, a happy family, not just relatives, people that accept you for who you are and the way you are, and they identify with you. So some of you are maybe a love aspect. Others of you all is you being connected to the right spiritual family. This is also spiritual names being released. This is also spiritual assignments manifesting, people helping you materialize things in your life, partnerships, connections, uh, this could be something going on with your finances as well. It's been a long time coming, but it's coming through. This is the, it's the end of a hard journey, the end of a hard shift, the end of hurt and pain. You've been waiting and here it is. All right, Holy Spirit, there's an offer coming through for you. Divine Feminine. The Knight of Pentacles, slow and steady. This definitely has taken a long time. You've missed it. Some of you all, it could have been something that you were you were doing incorrectly and you had to catch like some sort of sign, some sort of signal. Uh, you could have rejected something that you thought was not right. And now you're getting like a redo a second time around. This is like a second chance at something for some of you all. Others of you all, it's something that you didn't see, but guess what? Here it is, it's coming. See this ace of cups? This is this this is something right here that's gonna build you up as well. Uh some of you all may be placed in particular positions or places in life of authority, uh, where people kind of um they just highly exalt you. It's not that, you know, people aren't important. But there's something important getting ready to take place in your life. The two of wands, much planning, preparing, delegating things, prioritizing things. You all need to get ready. You need to position yourself. I feel like a woman in the birth room. Her legs open. You got to push. You got to keep praying until something happens. You got to keep meditating until it happens. You got to keep warring in the spirit until it's happening. Because some of you are getting love. Others of you are. It could be some money you've been waiting on. It could have been relationships. It could also um, be like some sort of breakthrough or some sort of blockage that you've had around your life and your energies. But you're in the birth position. Those of you all that are manifesting uh, people, this is something that's going to wow you. It's, it's, it's going to change you. That's why it took so long. Because some of y'all, I don't know. These, these must be some, you know, pretty dope families. Everything is not about money. But this is going to be like family members. You know, people that become family to you. But you don't have the same blood. Divine feminine, Holy Spirit. See where I, I, I told you. People are going to highly exalt you. Like... A princess, a prince. There are going to be envious people. That's what it is. Um, some of you all, you're going to have to make a choice to leave certain people behind. It could be certain family members. Excuse me, it's cer certain relatives. You, you, if you don't understand, if you do not understand the difference between relatives and families, 
relatives or people that we are biologically related to, family or those that love you. Um, this could be some of you all being adopted into different cultures, um, nationalities, people um of you know foreign languages and foreign lands. It could be people that you you it could be just some of you all traveling to these places. It's something the Holy Spirit is going to open you up and give you exposure to. You're getting ready to get a significant amount of exposure. Now, some of you all, there could be someone very important that's coming into your life. And this important person, guess what? This person has a lot of resources. They know a lot of people. And you're getting ready to receive power. I'm being reminded of uh, something Bishop T.D. Jake said about when his ministry took off. You know, the blessings that his wife received that was bestowed upon her life. She got more authority. She got more um, access. She got more power it's something you're getting more this is this is your this is going to be more so some of you all you're going to have like those relatives that are broken hearted it's like people that didn't appreciate you when things were going slow they're going to really look at your life and be like man some people slept on you and some people just thought that you would never get anything this right here is going to be a game changer it's going to be a major game changer. It's going to organize your life. It's going to make you more structured. It's going to make you more disciplined. It's going to make you very solid. I do see relationships, but I do see like a lot of opportunities. The hermit card. You may need to go within so you can recognize what you should and should not share. Look at there. The four wands. Get ready for these relationships. Get ready. Be prepared. For solidness, family, the four of wands. It's something about family here. I told you the two of wands, get prepared, be ready. Because God is giving you the spirit of adoption. Someone is getting ready to take you in. Uh, there's also going to be something new that someone here does. The, the type of work that you do, it's going to change. It's going to change. You're going to be able to relate to these people more. Now, some of you all, you could be getting ready to tap into your um your tribe that you need to connect with, or you could be a tribal leader. But somebody, somebody, some of y'all are going to be leading, but some of you all are going to be following some really great people. Interact and relate, community, family, traditions. So some of you all is access to your um community. Others of you all is family. Uh, others of you are some traditions, some sort of custom, some sort of system that you're, you're tapping into. Whatever this is y'all doing, y'all doing the darn thing, honey. Divine Feminine Holy Spirit. Take time out. You need to take some time away. You need to rest. You need to recharge. You need to balance your energies. You don't need to over overextend yourself. Do not tell everybody what's going on in your life. Some of you all with the temperance card here and the hermit card and the knight of pentacles, you got to keep quiet. You got to keep things on a on the low, on the hush, because something is developing that you've been working on for a long time. Many of you all, it's not just relationship, it's just your overall life. It's like the final stage of the paradigm shift, and now you see things happening on the physical side. Teach and share, uh-huh, instill, instruct, educate. So this could be what people are going to come into your life and do. But this is also for some of you all, what you're getting ready to do for, um, due to others. Awaken your inner shaman, connect, invoke, and heal. See, this is the next level of healing. You're going to be connected to family, people that are just like you. It's something about a spiritual tribe as well. And you're going to evolve even the more in the spirit. But this time, things that you say, bam, it's going to happen. You put your hand to something, boom. You'll see miracles. You will see things change. You're getting ready to have, this is the Midas touch. You have the Midas touch in your life. Be careful what you say. Other people's words don't affect you. Yours do. So you've, you've been, you're being gifted with the Midas touch. You need more money? Say it. They're going to give you more ideas. You're going to get promotions on your job. You're going to get elevated. You're going to be called upon. You're being looked upon as a, as a very dependable person, a hardworking person, a trustworthy person, but a person that is worthy of promotion, of elevation. Get ready. This is just your season. Lastly, embrace your inner gypsy. 
freedom, fun, music. Some of you all are going to be living and experiencing things, but you're also going to be experiencing different type of people. So get ready for more exposure. This is going to be really good. Fans, you deserve this. All right. Look at there. Golden opportunity. I hear that song about Mary Mary. Go get your blessing. So this is a divine blessing being sent to you. Sorceress, you are a magical person who can manifest your clear intentions into reality. I told you. You're being gifted with the Midas touch. Everything you say is going, is going to manifest. When you touch things, it's going to turn into pure gold for your life. Fairness. The situation will be handled in a fair and just manner. This is the um, Holy Spirit justifying things in your life. It's just time. See right here, you have a bright future. You have no need to worry. Stop worrying. Everything is going to be fine. Peace and blessings. Great day, fams. I'm so happy and proud of you all. You deserve this. Happy Monday. Namaste.